Hey, what's up everybody? Tommy here, Math Productions, and this video did not go at all um, as I expected, or was hoping or anticipating whenever I uh, sat down to start playing and started recording and thinking of what I was going to do. Fully intended on going through, adding a couple new mods, and showing off some new mods that I haven't yet used. <laughs> oh man. Let's just say uh, it, it didn't go well, right? So, two mods that I ended up landing on were just in a skin uh, for an Equinox, and then the gang is all here. I've been really excited, looking forward to this mod coming to Xbox. This video is in no way a critique on this mod, um, period. I think that it's my fault that it ended up going so sideways. And I'll explain that later on. Um, I'll explain it right now. So, like, look. So, initially, when I was looking at the mods, I found the gang is all here. And it says to load it whenever you do not have a companion follower or anybody following you or anything like that. So, I loaded into our save. Made sure. I was pretty sure I didn't have anybody following me, but I wanted to make sure. Verified nobody was following me. So, I doubled back out. And I went ahead and downloaded uh, the Gang is All Here plus that uh, Equinox skin. And uh, so what I'm doing now is setting them in the load order. Uh, if you haven't checked out my other video on how to set your load order, definitely check that out. It shows you how to add mods and move them around to an existing load order. Um, so that's what I'm doing here is I put the Equinox skin with the other skins. I put the Gang is All Here up near the top with my fundamental change type mods. Put it in line uh, with the follower companion NPC type changes and I felt like that was a good place to uh, start. So we went back in and uh, continued our save. We chose our current load order since we just changed it. If we would have clicked save it would have acted like we did. Oh yeah so this is where it started to go south. Like I was saying though if you, you have to choose current so that way it will show up with the changes that you made. Clearly, we broke the game with the two mod additions that we added. Um, yeah, it froze on me trying to exit, so I went ahead and just did a hard exit out of the game, loaded it back up, went back to creations. I feel like I already had two skins. I added one more in its place where it was, so I didn't feel like that was the culprit. So I feel like it has to be the gangs all here. Um, and maybe it just didn't like where I put the mod. So what I'm trying to do here for my uh, second attempt loading in with this updated load order, this time I'm choosing the hard save. The exit save at the top is the one that we already know is corrupted. So we're going back to our last hard save. Again, we're using the current load order because we just moved the gang is all here down to the very bottom. Um, we're going to see what happens there. So we load it back in, in the lodge. The lodge seems to be good. Kind of wandering around looking for some of our companions. So this is where I realized when I started editing the raw footage. Oh, I think that my issues... So remember I said for the gang is all here when you initially load it, install and load it, it says do not have a follower. Well, in the main quest line, we're at a point, and this is where when I saw this part, when I was cutting up which clips I was going to use or whatever, I was like, why is it not showing any of my constellation companions it's just showing the other ones oh because even though i'm not technically on a high price to pay the quest that i am on short-sighted is like the prelude into high price to pay so it's already kind of hard locking and setting constellation companion statuses so i'm pretty sure all of what we're watching right now is entirely my fault <laughs> But anyway, so trying to troubleshoot again, back to the tutorial on how to try to fix um, your broken save once you updated your load order with a new mod. I tried moving the load order, that didn't work. So now what I'm doing is just disabling um, the mod that I think is the culprit, right? So I got it disabled and now I'm going back into the hard save. Ah! Ah, but so the current, the idea again, choosing current with the mod disabled, maybe that would fix it for us. It did not, um, obviously. So, 
So we exit out, we go back in, we're scrolling down, we scroll down too early. Little pro tip, if you wait for it to say reloading on your uh, load order, the creations page itself, you won't have that little delay when it eventually does load in where it jumps your cursor back to the top. Um, let's try another attempt. So basically what I'm working through the thought process is I found out two mods broke the game. I changed the load order. Okay. <laughs> See kids, that's what happens when you choose violence. <laughs> but, uh, so I tried, I tried to change the load order, that didn't help. So I tried disabling one of the mods, that didn't help. Tried disabling the other mod, that didn't help. Um, spoilers, if I haven't shown it yet, because I can start getting sidetracked. So here we go, so that's where I just disabled the uh, Equinox skin. I already had Gang is All Here disabled, I just deleted them both. That was where I was getting to. My next step, just delete the two new additions outright. Um, try to load into the hard save. Okay. Const inside the lodge never is broken. Oh, why? I literally removed. Haha! <laughs> I literally have removed both the mods that I added that broke my game. I've reset the load order to what this save was already used to. And look at this, the game is still broken. <laughs> oh man, that fall cracks me up. But so, what can we do? We're gonna delete the corrupted file and I'm gonna delete all of the excess files. Is there a reason? No, it makes me feel better. I feel like maybe it's gonna help. Do I actually think like scientifically it helps? No, um, but it made me feel better. So, because again, again, I've already deleted those mods, so maybe I just delete some of those old saves, exit out of the game completely, load back in, fingers crossed. Come on, we're back! Yes! Okay. So, lesson learned. Tommy, consider not just the actual status of your uh, followers, but also maybe consider the quest you're on to before you try to uh, show off that mod next time. But I hope this video helps. Take care.